In this video, I'm going to show you how to use NG Packager in Angular 6. NG Packager is a package generator for Angular. In Angular 6, the function to automatically output the setting file for NG Packager has been added. This makes building a library very easy. In this video, I'm going to explain how to use it through creating a very simple footer component library. At first, we're going to make a project by Angular 6. It is for testing our component library. Type ng new project name. Any project name will do. This process will take a considerable amount of time. Then change into the project directory. Next type called dot for starting Visual Studio code. In a VS code, open the command line window by typing control back apostrophe key. Then type NGS for starting local server. In a browser, open localhost colon 4200. You will find the default page. OK. Back in the VS Code, type Ctrl C and Y return to stop the server. Next, we are going to make a component library. In command line, type ng generate library footer sample. This library command generates project directory in the root of the application. Open this directory, you will find footer sample directory. And in it, package.json, ngpackage.json file and source directory. Package.json file defines the library's name, dependencies and version. NGPackage.json file defines library's entry point and so on for NGPackager. In source directory, you will find public API.ts file and lib directory. Public API.ts file defines all components, services, and modules which we want to make available to the outside wall. In lib directory, you will find templates for components, services, and modules. We need to modify these files for our own component. We don't need services files, so delete these files. Open 
put the sample.component.this file and modify it for our own footer. Next, we are going to check this library by our application. Open app.module.this file and import footer sample module. Then open app.component.html file. Add leave footer sample tag in the bottom of the file. Save this file. Then check the library. Type NGS for starting local server. In your browser, open localhost colon for certain 200. You will find our original footer. OK. Back in the VS code, type Ctrl C and Y return to stop the server. Open package.json file in the root directory. We need to add a build command for ng packager. Add build column lib command in the switch section. Dash p means project. We need to point ng package.json file. Save this file. Type npm run view curl live in the command line. There are errors. I forgot to delete. The service lines in public API.ts file. Delete this file. Save this file. Then again type npm run build com live. Then you will find this file and a new command line by clicking plus icon. Then change into this slash footer sample directory. We can upload this library to GitHub by typing npm publish that. But this is a test library so we are going to make a table that is tgz file for worker testing type npm pack dot
Then we are going to check the library by another consumer project. At first, move the table to a certain local library directory. We are going to make a consumer project. Type energy new consumer. It will take some time. Change into the project directory. Next type called dot for starting Visual Studio Code. Then install the local turbo. Type npm i dash dash save turbo file path. Open node module directory. You will find footer sample directory. Then we need to modify app.module.this file for the consumer project. Import footer sample module. Finally, open app.component.html file and add live footer sample tag and insert some text. Here, I am going to insert this footer is a some uh, footer of the consumer project. Save this file. Chain to the first command line and type NGS for starting local server. Then 
Back in the browser, you will find the footer including the original text. Okay. Alright. Thank you for watching.